Hello YouTube and today in this tutorial we are going to learn how to do simple addition with Visual Basic 2010 Express. So what we're going to do is open up Microsoft Visual Basic 2010 Express, click on new project, let it load here, the new project form will come up, select Windows Forms application and uh, under name we'll just call it addition and we'll press OK. This will load up your project. It might take a minute uh, and is generally a little slow. Once that's loaded, we'll see Form 1 uh, on the screen here. And we can sort of resize this to whatever we want. We're just going to have a small rectangular window for this program because it's really only going to do one thing, and that is add two numbers together. Uh, so we're going to need to go to the toolbox and we're going to need to get a label. Just drag it over onto our window, and if we click the label, go down to Properties, Text, and change Label 1 to blank. We just backspace it, and it becomes a blank label. However, it disappears from our screen, but if we run our cursor over it, we can see the label still there, just got nothing in it. Uh, put it in the center of your window, or wherever you like, really. Uh, just so long as there's enough room to print our answer on the screen. And depending what size numbers you use will depend on how long the answer will be. So if we again go and double click on the form, and we uh, load up our code here, and it says private sub form one load. So what this code does is anything you write in this section here, will be, um, any code in here will be triggered when the form loads. So it'll run automatically as soon as you open up the form, which is what we want. So we're going to go dim as number one, comma, number two, as string, as integer, sorry. And then we're going to set number one to equal ten and number 2 to equal 25. Now we're going to set label 1 uh, then dot text to equal number 1 plus number 2. Okay, now we can save this uh, call it whatever you like, choose where you'd like to save it, and call it whatever you like. Tick create directory for solution, press save. Uh, so that's just saving our work here. So quite simple to add two numbers together, it's four lines of code. Uh, this first line here, dim number one, number two as integer. Okay, this is just declaring our variables, number one and number two. You can call these whatever you like uh, within reason. Uh, the next two lines are just getting our variables, number 1 and number 2, and giving them some initial values, in this case 10 and 25. Now if we add 10 and 25 together, this should equal 35. Let's see if it all works out. The last line, the fourth line of our code here, label1.txt equals number 1 plus number 2, this is getting label1.txt, which is basically the, the text value inside our label that we placed on our form, and it's setting this value to equal number 1 plus number 2. What the computer will do is get the value for number 1, which is 10, and the value for number 2, which is 25. It'll add them together, and the answer that you get will be displayed in label 1.txt for us to see. So if we go up here and press the Run button, start debugging, uh, you can also press F5 on the keyboard, we should see that happen, and we should get an answer of 35. And there it is, 35 uh, is our expected answer, and it's the answer that we receive. Therefore, our code is working properly. So if we press the stop button there, or on your keyboard, you can go Control alt break That'll stop debugging the program, make sure everything's saved, and that is how to do simple addition in Microsoft Visual Basic 2010 Express. In the next video, we're going to learn how to get input from the user so that the user can input to specific numbers that are then added. Uh, but until then, thanks for watching, uh, and please comment if you have any questions, and subscribe.